hello everyone welcome back to the channel in this simple video i would like to show you something cool so currently i've been active on tiktok and these guys have shown me some good love so from 90 followers to the number that you're seeing on your screen 4082 followers you know i just edited some videos and they kind of liked them and started following me so i was planning the moment i reach 5000 followers i make some cool animation and i wanted to animate this number from zero to 5000 followers the ones that i'm planning to make this animation on and to show you that this is a real account let me refresh somebody may say you are showing us a screenshot <laughs> now these are real numbers that you're seeing on your screen and i came up with this program no, it looks like I just made the layout to look like TikTok, as you can see here. You can tell the font size, stuff like that. The font family isn't the same, but you know, why not? I just wanted to come up with this cool animation. So I wanted to animate the number of followers, as I said, from 0 to 5,000, the one that I'm planning on to do the animation on. And take note, this program doesn't work with case, so... You don't expect it to for you to reach 20,000 likes or followers and it puts a K. Right now, we don't have it in the functionality. It will loop until that number, it reaches that number without adding a K. Unless we are to, um, to add, or me and you, I may make this open source. And we add that functionality. So when it reaches, let's say 10K, we added a K there, right? And this is what we are having. So if I'm, as you can see right now, this is the local host. If I'm to refresh this page, it's going to start from zero and start animating. And that's all coming from my JavaScript file here. So here you set the number of subscribe, sorry, followers. And now I'm used to YouTube, the number of followers that you want to animate through. And the reason why I'm putting or incrementing a one here. When they clear the interval, it always be less down by one number. So if you put 82, it will be 81. So the reason why I increment it by one, for it to be the exact number that we put here. So the moment they reach this condition, it will be less than by one. So I just add on a one for it to be the exact number that we are incrementing through. And here, I'm using the set timeout function. So for the set timeout function, as you can see here, it's waiting for 3,000 milliseconds, right? Those are 3 seconds. If I'm to refresh this page, as you can see, it will show zero. After 3 seconds, it starts incrementing or animating. And the one that is animating is the set interval. And they are calling this counter function every after 10 milliseconds. That's so fast. That's why you're using, that's why you're seeing this number changing at a fast rate. It's because we put the least milliseconds or the small milliseconds and that's why it's animating at that speed we can make these values to be coming from the user as i said if i'm to make this open source for me and you to work on we may create a form where the user will be able to submit his first name the second name right because some people have different names just for me that i chose the same name at times i see let's say mark here and down here I say Mark UG. I don't know how they do that. But we can make a form where the user will be the one to submit in the first name, second name, their profile image, their following, the followers that they want to animate through, and the likes, and the bio section. So for the image, you just go to TikTok, right click, copy image address, paste and go. So TikTok will show you your profile image. So we may create an input field where you can submit all that. And the moment you click submit, we show you this page and start animating the follower value. Right? And that's what I was planning to do. So I wanted to come up with this cool animation. And there was no program online that was able to do this. And the friend told me, you can use After Effects or Adobe Premiere Pro. And to tell you the truth, I don't have skills in those softwares. So I just choose some simple JavaScript here. As you can see, those are 18 lines to come up with this cool animation. For the layout, that's Flexbox, the one that also TikTok uses, right? 
yeah that's what i wanted to show you guys and i'm planning to create this record this the moment i reach 5000 followers on tiktok so for you who was wondering how can i record this just pull up any screen recorder that you have obs screencast ice cream any screen recorder that you'll be able to use and record that so if you think this tutorial was useful to you please subscribe to the channel like the video share it on different social medias and i'll see you in the next tutorial remember i'm pushing this code to github for you guys to play around with peace